This is joining us now for a look at a brand new driving me crazy segment and Chris this time you're focusing on those traffic roundabouts roundabouts. Yeah, know how to navigate one seen one drive yeah, through one absolutely. recently. I put the question on my Facebook page and uh, apparently we're having a little trouble with this. Okay, so Kev <laughs> writes you feel like Clark Griswold in European vacation. That's a great scene. That's Big Ben Parliament. Yes. Big yep. Ben Parliament. Anyone? All right. Bill says people do need to learn to use their turn signals both coming into huh. and out of the circle. And Liz in Vancouver says, yeah, they do keep traffic flowing usually. And that's what they're designed to do. Keep traffic flowing, mm -hmm. make it a little safer through the intersections. But there's two new roundabouts in McMinnville that are taking a little getting used to. So we're going to have that coming up on Thursday's driving me crazy segment. I never thought to use my signal going into the circle. I haven't either. Well, I'm me going either. into the circle. Where else am I going? You know, <laughs> yeah. I'm going into the circle. And I think the biggest complaint is also people that stop unnecessarily. So they yield, but then there's oh, traffic yeah, coming right. from like mm -hmm. a long distance and they wait and they wait and they wait. Yeah. It's one of those things that's costing it. people time. It kind of irks them a little bit. Yeah, no, I can yeah. see that. I didn't yeah. see the turn signal comment coming though. All right. Well, if you have an idea or something that drives you crazy on, on the, the roads, roads. Let, <laughs> yeah, on the roads or with really with whatever, email Chris at cmcginnis at kgw.com. You can also find him on Facebook or Twitter.